Okay, so this is a video I think would be very popular with YouTube users and YouTube users that have blogs. Because what we're looking at here is how you can automatically get your YouTube videos, your YouTube uploads published on your blog on both Blogger and WordPress. Okay, so to do this I'm using a site called IFTTT or if this then that. And IFTTT is a site that allows you to connect different online services in, in different ways. And what I've done is I've created two recipes. Once you create something on it's called a recipe. And I've created two recipes, one of them to connect both Blogger and YouTube, and the other one to connect both YouTube or WordPress and YouTube. And once I created these recipes, I tried them out, I tested them out, and once I was happy with them, I then made them public. And once I make my recipe public, then everybody can use them, which is why I'm going to show you how you can use them in this video. So um, what exactly happens is um, once you connect up your blog with your YouTube channel, um, on IFTTT, um, you're basically given permission for the videos that you upload on YouTube to be posted on your blog, and that's the main thing that you're allowing permission for this to happen. And really, we want to look at what actually happens and what actually gets um, transferred from YouTube to your blog because I've seen something on this before where people were kind of getting their feed to publish onto their blog which always looks messy it doesn't look right at all so with IFTTT it looks a lot better so I did this on a test blog I connected a test blog with my YouTube channel and then the last video I uploaded um, then was automatically published onto my test blog so let's have a look at that so you can see this top post here on this test blog and here is exactly what got automatically published um, so what happens is the video title, so the title that you give to the video on YouTube, that gets used as the title for the blog post. So here's the video, which is automatically remove links and comments on Blogger. And on our test blog, here you can see how that got used um, as the post title. Then below that we have some actual text and content and what's actually used here is the description that you give the video. Now, obviously this description doesn't fit perfectly but it was for a test so you can kind of write out your video description a lot better knowing that it's going to be used in the blog post. So if I look at the video description here, which is this part, you can see that was used here as text. And then of course the video itself was embedded within the post. Now there is a little problem with the tags as in you can't actually pick up the, the labels that you use on YouTube and use them but you can as I'll show you soon enough add your own labels etc. Let's have a look at that in, in the post editor as in this is the post editor in HTML so this is exactly what was automatically published so you can see here the, the comment. Of course this is on a blogger test blog but it'll work out the very same on WordPress. So this is the title, you can see here this is the text that was used and you can see here where the where the video was uploaded. You can see here with the difference with the ift.tt rather than the YouTube. So you can see how basically IFTTT um, uploaded the video rather than YouTube. So um, as I say, a fantastic way to automatically update or upload videos onto your blog. Okay, so that's enough about how it's how it's does it let's see exactly how it's done so the two recipes I created I will have on a post here on spice up your blog so there'll be a link in the description if you're watching this on YouTube to come on and you can see here I've actually embedded the boat recipes so you can see here the boat recipes by myself Paul Crow and actually I only made this a little while ago and already 20 people have used this recipe so before I even published this video so it's, it's obviously quite popular um, and basically once you come onto this you will click use to use that recipe and I have them open here this is the first one here auto post YouTube uh, videos on your WordPress blog and you will come to this you will click use recipe and once you come through to the next page now you can see I already have my blogs connected so I have blog connected with a WordPress blog which I just done for testing so you will have to actually go through the process of first of all verifying your YouTube account and then verifying your WordPress account both perfectly self safe and once you connect up your two blogs you can then go down and you have some options here which I've left so this is basically the post it creates on WordPress and as I say a couple of options so first of all the title basically what we have here is it's using the showing that it's using the title from YouTube on the WordPress you can see here description which means it's using the YouTube description the embed code which is the YouTube to embed your video now what you can actually do here is if you want to add extra to every time you upload a, a video 
you can add some extra text in here that you might or links or, or whatever you want to add and just add them in there and click out and that'll save and that'll be fine so you can add some extra text there are some options now on YouTube for the categories now I've added the title in here you might not want this so that will put the whole title as a category which probably isn't a good idea but if you wanted you could get rid of this and just put in um, videos and that would go that would go in as a category on your blog as videos and in your tags you could change that once again to videos or if the only videos you, you, you upload are on photography you could put that in as photography etc 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 whoever you type in here you can then have as the tags and as the categories um, and there are a couple of options here to select ingredients for this recipe where you could use the URL or, or the author name which would be your own name so there are a couple of options I've left open there um, once you're happy with that you can see how I have it as published immediately now you can save it as a draft so basically it won't be published but the embed code will be put in the description code and you can go in then and finish it off and put on your finishing touches and it'll just save you some time so you can have, have it saved as a draft and obviously to publish as, pi, pi, uh, as, as publish as private and once you're happy with it all that you click update and then that's done and every time you upload a video that will be posted on your WordPress blog so let's go next to the blogger one and very 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 same thing um, new upload video on blogger or on what YouTube goes onto your blogger blog you will click use recipe the options are the same only of course we have labels on this we don't have categories and tags we just have labels so you can see the options are pretty much the very same as you go down along change your labels here and you can update to use this and with this the blogger you don't have the option to save it as a draft unfortunately um, so it has to be published but I think that's fine either way and so that's the two recipes and exactly how they work and that I imagine it'll be quite popular with, with YouTube users to come and get the links to both these uh, recipes and um, click the link in the description if you're on YouTube and um, that will bring you to this post and spice of your blog and you can use these recipes I will leave these as public so anybody can be able to use them for, for any amount of time and that's about it start up auto posting thanks for watching the video